Okay, uh, Lord, what's next? User left your channel. The next stage is the other strategy used because while you can use damage, the other method that, to keep your friends alive is healing. Instead of distracting the opponent, you will support your friends while they're being attacked. This is used using the. Uh, there's an engineer, engineering captain trait called uh, called power transfer, which is uh, which will boost the in all the power levels of your friends. Yep, it's one moment, it's uh, 30.9 all power settings for 30 seconds and plus 185.2 percent power transfer rate for 30 seconds so this is also an ability you can send to your teammates to boost their power levels okay go on mm -hmm. you also have hazard emitters which is a uh, transfer ability that can heal them instead of yourself you also have uh, transfer shield strength which is again is transferring your shield strength to them boosting them and the engineering ability uh, extend shields which can only be used on allies it um, it provides a, a longer boost than transfer shield strength will and a bigger boost have that in mind that uh, emerge, uh, extend shields their maximum range is I uh, I think seven kilometers. Five. How many? Seven. 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 Yeah. And transfer shield straight is ten. So have that also in mind. Okay, go on, uh, Lord. Yeah, so that covers the basic abilities. Um, well, you, well, as I said, while you do want to be tanking naturally with the innate abilities of a cruiser. If you're healing someone, then it, it also not only supports your teammates who are being attacked, but it will distract the opponent and make them go for you. And we're yes. going to demonstrate this. If we have... Let's see. Um, Lord, you can attack... Let's see. Guys, go go down. Go down to me. You can attack um, Nikki and I'll heal her. I have limited healing, but that would be sufficient. Okay, Nikki, stand by, Lord attack. There's, you might want to move. Sirs, move. I'll move it, move it out. So you want everybody to attack Nikki? Or no, just, just no. Lord, just, just Lord. Me. Okay. So now I'm sending uh, hazard emitters. Next is EPTS. And that's pretty much it I have on my disposal. But uh, but Hoshi also notified that uh, well, Hoshi, uh, since Hoshi is using a, a attack based cruiser, the Galar class. Uh, it doesn't have that much too much uh, spaces for the full uh, uh, to be a full time healer. But say ships like Odyssey, who says who had the Lieutenant Commander Universal uh, both uh, stations, can turn themselves into a, as a full time healer with secondary engineer or uh, secondary science, or into more uh, tank uh, DPS oriented. So yeah. bear in mind that lots of ships so. Uh, who have a uh, universal uh, slot, slots can uh, create a multi base build. Okay, go, go, go. Try to defend. This is my last hazard meters. Typically, when you have, typically in a, uh, a team battle, you have at least one or two cruisers. If you have multiple, mm -hmm. then if you have a squishy escort or you have a science vessel that's under attack, if both of them are healing at the same time, then it was almost guaranteed to keep that ship alive. Yes. Also, we have cross heal, but that will cover in another set. Okay, I think that's that's enough. So, when you are trying to heal. 
use the tab so you have them selected and just press the, uh, the ability you want to send to them so let's say hazard emitters as I'm now sending to Nikki or uh, EPTS for their power levels to have them selected and this Nick is now uh, sending me a trace machine strength one so just remember transfer shield strength one has a 10 kilometer range uh, EP, uh, extend shield which is primarily used for uh, healing your teammates has 7 kilometer range so have that in mind who wants to be uh, our next healer? I can try healing this time. Okay. So, Lord, you can attack me. Also to note, while you are healing your allies, it is not supposed to be the only thing you're doing. You can be attacking whoever is attacking your teammate as you're healing them, so that, that means they have more to deal with and it makes it hard for them to stay alive. Best not to focus purely on one profession, uh, as in all healing, all tanking, it's best to have a combination of them all. Also, if you're a full tank healer, and uh, like uh, Dr. said, you want to do also something before just uh, toss uh, healing to all the, to your teammates. You, if since as a healer you're sacrificing t them, and that means you will probably have the maybe depends on the person's uh, player's build. You will have to sacrifice tactical uh, console that boost damage for say more universal yeah, the ones. The universe one that puts uh, healing uh, stuff and uh, other uh, uh, props. And that way, then uh, the tactical probably say uh, beam fired will could be then used as a clean a spam cleaner. Since in lots of PvP matches, you will encounter uh, side players with uh, types of shoes like Vesta and other uh, carrier base that have pets. So your uh, fired will as a healer can help your teammates uh, to uh, not encounter them. I think that's enough. Yes. Uh, I think that's enough uh, for me, who, for Nikki, who wants to be a uh, next healer? I'll do it. Okay, Hunter. I'll attack. Who's on your side? I'll attack. Uh, so I can't attack, sorry. Uh, Hunter, you'll heal... Uh, you'll heal... Nikki while... Uh, Summer Wolf attacks her. So Summer Wolf attack Nikki, Hunter, you heal. Roger that. This is transfer shield strength. Good. Good. He's also close to her and using shield frequency modulation, so have that in mind also and as cruiser abilities. Do you have any other uh, healing? Is that ha hazard emitters? Good.
good. Okay, that's very good. You can stop. Uh, who's left? Spud and I'll attack. I'll attack uh, Spud and we need a healer on that side. Shen is heal Spud. Okay, so hazard emitters. Now, uh, Shen is just sent you hazard emitters. Oops. Very good. Good distraction. What else? Uh, which else shield you can send him? Show this. Uh, yep. I have sent him one, and this is uh, three and two. Okay, give him TSS three. Good, good. Also, a note for those that wish to fly a Romulan um, cruiser. The abilities uh, such as Up Shadow can be very effective as distractions. Yep. Okay, that's that's very now we'll reverse it. I'll attack Shenis spy one moment. Class. No actually uh, I'll attack um Shenis uh no uh Shenis attack me, uh Sirs heal me. Okay. Oh. One moment, it says come closer. You're in the guard? Yep. What uh, healing abilities do you have, sirs? Sighting. Uh... Has a Demeters? No. Transfer shield strength? No. Um... Engineering yeah. team. Engineering team. Where I got that? I emerges power to I uh, power transfer three. No. What uh, what what do you have? Uh, engineering team, science team, tech team. Oh. Uh, that's it. Th that's that's not good. You can't have three teams because they share cooldown. So one is pretty much useless. So for healing, you must have at least hazard emitters or um, the uh, transfer shield strength. So we don't need to demonstrate this as you don't have healing abilities. Uh, does anyone have uh, any questions? Or want to I demonstrate? do. Yes, go ahead. Go on. I have engineering team one on the Excelsior. Should I like get rid of it or should I replace it with something else? No. No, 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 no. You are using aux to bat card. Yes, uh, engineering team uh, as a, a hull kill power on the aux to bat is uh, necessary because if you have uh, it's more uh, better usable than say hazard meters uh, since hazard meter requires high auxiliary and with aux to bat build your uh, draining auxiliary your does auxiliary your hazard meter. Yes, those your auxiliary uh, has emitted won't work that much as the engineering team. So stick with the engineering team. And if you have dual locks to battery, uh, also get uh, one tactical team. One engineering team, one tactical team. I have both those and I also have an aux to bat one. 
Uh, just one Oxalbait one? Yeah, just just that one. Okay. So I have two reverse sh uh, shield polarities, um, one direct energy uh, modulation, and two uh, two kay. energy powder shields. Okay, so I lose one reverse shield polarity and put their auxiliary to battery one, additional one. So have two auxiliary to batteries. You only need one yeah. one reverse shield pol polarity. Okay. Anything? Uh, anyone else? Any questions? Sirs? Yes? Uh, are what? you in a tech or an engineer? No. Engineer. Okay, so... What engineering abilities do you have? Engineering team 1. Okay. Uh, boarding party. What? Sorry? Boarding party. Boarding party, party lose that Red. one. Okay, next. Uh, reverse shield polarity 2. Uh, you don't need that. Yeah, no, you don't need that tool 1. 1, yes. Uh, and, okay. Modulation three. Okay, so, uh, lose uh, boarding party and uh, reverse shield polarity. Where you have boarding party, put reverse shield polarity 1, and where your reverse shield polarity 2 was, put emergency power to shield 3. You could also possibly lose the engineering and replace that with another, another emergency power to shield. Uh, okay, but uh, do you have only one engineering officer or two? Uh, <coughs> two. Okay, uh, what uh, the second one has? Which abilities? Emergency part of shields one. Um, part of weapons. Uh, Two, I think it is. Yeah, two. What? You don't need that. What? Sorry, I didn't... Emergency power to weapons. You don't need it. Yes. You're a... While a tank... While a tank can be used for damage, it's typically not with the... Um, emergency power to weapons. Yeah, it's so... With the actual weapons you have. So, lose that emergency power to weapons and put, let's say, um... Extend shields. So you can heal others. Got it? Yeah. Okay, so anyone else? Uh, Mac? Summer Wolf? Um, while I was watching you guys, I switched out and added that uh, emergency power to shield which you suggested. Are you in uh, engineer or tech? Uh, in, uh, in, in which ship are you? This is the Mirror Heavy Cruiser Retrofit. Okay, and yeah. are you in a tactical or engineer? Uh, it would be an engineering ship. Okay. So, which engineering abilities do you have? Uh, besides the innate ones? Yes, like, uh, I mean, which buff one? abilities? Buff abilities do you have? Sorry. Which was that first one? Engineering team one, okay. which I've got okay. two of those. I need to change one of them. Okay. Uh, reverse shield polarity, emergency power to shields three. Okay. Uh, ox to sif one and three. You only need uh, one. You only need uh, one ox to sif. So. So. I've got hazard emitters, sh um, transfer shield strength. Okay. That's good. Any other engineering uh, buffs? Do you have one or two? There's... that's... Oh, okay. I have two engineer slots. Okay. One of them commander, one lieutenant. Commander and lieutenant. Commander. Okay, so uh, lose one engineering team and uh, you can also put uh, extend shields on that one. 
think the other ones are pretty good. Doesn't extend shields a science ability? No, it's an nope. engineering one. Okay, uh, Spud, are you in uh, Psy or uh, Engineer now? I'm in my uh, Engineer in the Engineering Odyssey Cruiser. Okay, so nice. which... Are, okay. I've got Emergency Power to Shields 1 and 3, Transfer Shield Strength 1 and 3, or uh, Extend Shields 1 and 3, I should say. Uh, engineering Team 1 and Ox to Bat 1 with... Uh, that's it. I have two copies of emergency power to shield, so I want to swap. Okay, those. no, no, that's good. But you have two copies of extend shields. You only need one. Add uh, yes. uh, in extend shields one put auxiliary to better one. Everything else seems okay. Any more questions? I just wanted to clarify something. Yes. Emergency powered weapons is just kind of an in the no go area. It doesn't add in which ship are you? To your uh, engineer Odyssey. Odyssey, engineer it, Odyssey or tactical? Odyssey engineer. Okay, so uh, which abilities do you have? I have. An Ox to Sif 3, a pair of Engineering Team 3, a pair of Emergency Powered Shields 2, and a pair of Emergency Powered Weapons 1. Oh. It's not, not good. Okay, so tell me from the start, first ability on your... Uh, you have a Commander, Engineer, and a Lieutenant Engineer? Lieutenant Commander, Engineer. Okay, so uh, tell me on the Commander Engineer from the start. Its abilities. Which one's the Ox first one? Ox one? to save three. Ox no. Okay, Ox to save three. Played. Engineering team three. Emergency okay. power to shields two. Emergency power to weapons one. Okay, so uh, leave Ox to save on. Uh, what's the next one? Engineering team three, was it? Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. uh, there put the emergency power to shield 3. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, and in uh, in uh, your emergency power to weapons put uh, emergency power to shields 1. And in the middle put the reverse shield polarity. Sorry, I did not mean to fire. No I was problem. trying to right clicky. Anything else? I'm just curious what you would want done with the lieutenant commander. Oh, engineer. lieutenant commander, sorry. Uh, what was there? Engineering Team 3, Emergency Power to Shields 2, Emergency Power to Weapons 1. So... You can there put... Uh, um, let me see... Uh, put an Engineering Team 1. Put External Shields 1. And... What's the third one? Anyone have any ideas? Right to the engine modulation? Yes. There you go. Decent way to distract someone. Yeah. Because that ship has so many engineering slots, it's well covered. Anyone you could have... throw in an ensign. You could throw into the, uh, en the ensign universal, you could throw in an emergency power to the engines. Just so when you mm. people start attacking, you can get the hell out of there. Yeah. Uh, but that's three emergency power, uh, emergency power abilities, so they are uh, they are on the same cooldown. Yeah, it would be it would be a bit risky, but yeah. if timed right, it could be a very useful daylight. Okay, uh, I think we are done with this sh session. If you guys don't have any more questions, and uh, mm. Lord, any last words? 
I don't believe so. I believe you've got it all. Okay, guys. Thank basically, you. Basically, stay alive. Yeah, stay alive. Thanks, so guys. you can deal damage or heal your teammates. Okay, guys. Thank you for participating in today's engineering sessions. See you next week on the science one. Bye.